Hello guys, welcome back to the Sims 3 Asylum Challenge. Holy cow, has it been a while. I am just <laughs> having the most difficult time keeping up with things lately. Um, I've just been kind of busy. Um, so yeah, um, no excuse really. <laughs> just been a little bit busy and um, a little bit overwhelmed. I have to record two weeks worth of videos this week. And it's just kind of a daunting task. Um, I'm gonna be gone the second week of April or something. So, yeah, a lot to do and not a lot of time to do it. So, that's what's been going on here. Um, but yeah, I want to make sure I can have videos up for you guys while I'm gone. And it'll be a good time. So... Um, what are we doing here? Jane is gonna make some mac and cheese and hopefully not burn down the kitchen. And as is typical, mostly everyone else is just standing around talking to themselves. So, super fun. Alright. Let's see, can she do it? Can she do it? It looks like she can. Wow. Nice job, Jane. Killing it. Alright, so let's grab a bowl of mac and cheese. Really, Coco? Coco's like, um, no, I'd like mine first. Thanks. Uh. Alright, ladies, calm down. Go sit somewhere else. Good gracious. Alright, so let's check out what we've got here. So, um, I don't know. I think we could be good friends with Coco. I think we could make it happen. So let's uh, share a secret and ask about her day. What day is it? It's Wednesday. Okay. Okay. Oh, Jane, I appreciate your cleaning, but... Can you just do something else? Well, let's say hello to Ashley then. Let's, uh, discuss fine cuisine and announce our promotion. Keep the friendliness going. Looks like we have a gorgeous sunset happening right now, which is really, really pretty. I like it. Anyway, getting distracted. Uh, Forrest and Cody are not getting along at all. Big surprise there. Let's tell Ashley a funny story and show her a cat's video because we all know how much I like cat's videos. Pretty much obsessed. Alright, hopefully by the time that is over, we can get our hands on a shower. Come on. Lean on, get out. Use the bathroom. Take a shower. Ashley, no, get out of the bathroom. Alrighty, and then we gotta see if we can hop in a bed here. <clears throat> we'll see. Um... Come on. Come on. There we go. Nice work. Forrest, you can come sleep with us. Yeah, there you go. See, Forrest knows what is up. He's like, hey. Hey, girl. Thanks for saving me a spot. Forrest is adorable. Absolutely adorable. We'll have to uh, work on our relationship with him some more. So, let's just go ahead and speed three through the night and keep an eye on everyone here. Um, let me see. Okay, forgot to start my timer. So, what's going on, guys? What you doing? Hmm, I'm trying to think of what we can add to this lot that will make things a little more interesting. Um, a few 
few of you did recommend separating the toilets and the showers, which isn't a bad idea, and I might do that eventually. I just don't particularly feel like it right now. Um, I do think I really want to start doing, like, I don't know, only giving them a certain amount of meals? But that takes up a lot of time because I can't control the other characters, so <clears throat> Jane would have to cook them. But I think what we're gonna do is since there's a couple food plates sitting here, we're gonna put that out and leave it to be the only food source for a little bit. Oh, I forgot to sell this chess table that we had. Perfect. There we go. So that will be all they can eat until um, I say so, basically. Um, this isn't a buffet, so they'll have to make do with what they have. Um, hopefully we can get Jane some food, so we'll make that a priority. <clears throat> Sorry, my throat is all, like, messed up. Couldn't tell you why. Couldn't tell you why. I'm not gonna throw a party because we don't have any friends, but today is spooky day, so that's pretty fun. Means we can spend a little time getting to know people. Alright, Jane, I'd really like you to get up and eat. Please. Just don't. You don't have to make the bed. Come on. Oh, it's disgusting. Well, can't always get what you want, can ya? Just suck it up, eat it, and get it done with. Okay, I think I'd like to listen to a timecast. And we will listen to the, um, um, shoot, let's do cooking. I think that'll be the next, one of the next jobs we get for her is the cooking career. So hopefully if we can build up our skills a little bit, it'll help us out quite a lot. For now, let's come tend the garden. Um, we still are a ways behind <laughs> in the gardening career, and we need two more promotions before we can move on with her lifetime wish, which is the jack of all trades. So yeah, we still got a long way to go. What's the matter with you? You're probably hungry. You'll survive. Make it work. Oh, okay, go barf. Go puke and then listen to the logic tabcast and come back up and tend the garden. So let's head downstairs and see what's going on here. No one's been booted out, so I think expanding the bathroom has definitely helped. Um, Melanie is very smelly. <laughs> Girl, you need to take a shower. You stink. I don't know why, I don't know what they're doing. I have no idea what they're doing. What's the matter, Forrest? Why are you crying over the shower? There's nothing wrong with it. You need to simmer down. Gosh, my outerwear is something, something weird, I'm telling you that. Okay. Mm. Well then, let's <laughs> come back up here. I think we'll put out another plate of food at noon. We'll put out another plate. That way, you know, they get their three meals a day, and if they don't get any, they don't get any. I just, I'm, <laughs> I really want some people to die. Is that terrible? It probably is, but I don't really care. Okay. So let me grab the fridge, and I just want to make sure that I can get to it. Here, open. Oh, everything's spoiled. <laughs> well, that's okay. They can eat the spoiled food. We'll just leave the fridge like that. They'll survive. They'll probably whine about it, but they'll survive. What is your problem? Plant is currently dormant. Well, what in the hell? Why? Weird. 
Okie dokie. Well, that's interesting. So, let's come over here and let's make a little bit of money. Um, not metals, we don't have any. Let's make a... Whatever these are. I don't, I don't know. And then maybe we'll spend a little time with forest for the rest of the day. Sounds good to me. Oh wait, did someone throw out the... I think someone threw it out. Here you go. Have some spoiled mac and cheese. What are you all doing in there? You crazy. We need to fix this toilet. That's what we need to do. So we'll cancel out one of those. And uh, see if we can't get in here. Oh, wow! Jane just made a masterpiece quality item worth 3,000 simoleons. What? Oh, it's a statue. That's why. Well, shit. We're selling that puppy. Hello. I think I might buy the unbreakable toilets, actually, then. At least one. I mean, I feel like at this point... Let me see. Can I get rid of this? Yes. Okay, so we're going to sell this. And we're going to buy an unbreakable toilet because I cannot take it anymore. So where is the cheapest never breaks? Never breaks. Never breaks. So I think this one. Alright, let's buy that puppy. <laughs> we're going to buy two. I'm so tired of fixing the toilets. It's not even enjoyable. Alright, so there we have that. And I think that's all we're going to buy for now. I don't want to go nuts here. But uh, let's uh, shower. Coco, if you could leave, that would be fantastic. Alright, where's Forrest? I want to have a little bit of canoodling with Forrest. I know, you're hungry. Let's, um, romantic hug. And then heat of the moment kiss, I think we'd like to do. And then I guess we'll make some proper food because they are all hollering. I'll let someone cook and just see what happens. Alright, let's see. Does he like it? Why are you in your- Oh! Oh, he doesn't. Maybe it's because he's hungry. Okay. Alright, sorry. Bad judgment. Let's apologize. And ask about his day. And, um... I don't know. Discuss fine cuisine. And then we will clean out the bad food and clean up the stuff. We'll let someone make a couple meals and then um, just go from there. Take out trash. Good. Alright, we are going to have her serve some goopy carbonara for dinner. That plate went fast. Holy moly. I don't know. We need to get Forrest on lockdown, man. Or he's going to get swept up. And I'm going to have to make some ladies really mad. Okay. So let's make our goopy carbonara. Go pee, girl. Oh, God. We're burning it. Really? Ugh. Too bad, you're eating it. Grab a plate. Grab a plate. I don't have time for your nonsense. Okay. Let's turn the fridge back around. I can probably put this away for now. Oh dear, oh dear. She wants to increase her cooking skill. That we can do. Oh, 
Well, that was relatively unsuccessful. Um, <laughs> didn't really accomplish all that much today. But let's have her listen to a tab cast. And what have we got going on here? Oh, Forrest is just not feeling it. He's just not feeling it. What's up with this painting? Let's sell it. Okay. Um. Rian, Xenon. Let's have a chat with Xenon really quick. Let's ask her about her day. And a funny, tell a funny story. And make a silly face. Let's try to get some relationships here. And then we need to find a bed. Who is in this bed? Um, Melanie. <laughs> Well, that's a problem, because we don't really get along with Melanie. Um, I could wake her up and see if I can boot her out of there. Use the bathroom. Any of you hooligans want to wake up, that'd be good. Yes, yes you do. Go sleep. Go sleep, girlfriend. Move! Haha. -ha. Suck it, Ashley. We are going to sleep here. Alrighty. So let's just speed three on through the night. I assume we have work tomorrow. Yes, we do. Working for the weekend. That's what we're doing. Um, and just another quick update on the homeless challenge. I still can't get Sims 2 to recognize my new graphics card. I don't really know what else to do about it, so, I mean, until I can figure it out, guys, I just can't, I can't play it, so, that's that, still no, still no updates, um, on what's going on with that, and that's a shame, because I really, really wanted to do that challenge and play some Sims 2, but, you know, the older the game gets, and the more advanced your computer gets they just don't get along very well so I'm doing what I can doing what I can just not working out okay so I think I will take away another bed I think taking away another single bed um, might make things a little bit more difficult um, let's see can I move this yes so we'll move this is kind of just a storage room. Like Somebody yelled at me, they're like, you have beds in that room, why don't you use them? This is just like storage. It's stuff they're not allowed to use, but I don't want to sell, or I don't want to just delete. So um, there we go. We got rid of another bed. So we're down to two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine sleeping spots for 16 Sims. So yeah. They're gonna have to figure it out. Let's uh, let's clean, or no, we don't wanna clean the shower. All right, get up, Jane, get up. Let's open the fridge, you guys can eat this horrifying quality goopy carbonara. If you're hungry enough, you will eat it. Yeah, you will, get it. And we'll just have Jane eat a tomato. <laughs> Cause she can, she tends the garden, she can do what she wants. And she's off. She's off to work. Let's work hard. We need to get these promotions going. I'd like her to move out of here before she's an elder, so hopefully we can, you know, break forest out and maybe start start a family. We'll see. Doing good, doing good. What's everyone doing? Are you eating jelly beans? Looks like they are. Um, assassin bug study. We don't have assassin bugs and I don't have time to look for them. So we are gonna do a quick inventory clean out. Cause as I can tell, the bookshelves are empty as always. Oh dear. People are starting to get mad. Okay, let's put this 
some in this bookshelf. Who's hoarding all the books? Definitely not Melanie. She doesn't read. Okie dokie. So let's just, what's, what's going on with everyone? Oh, um, Coco's starving. Chris is hungry. You'll be fine. Here, have some salad. Whiners. <laughs> Coco books it. She just books it for the salad. There. Good gracious, you guys. Such a bunch of babies. Alright, Jane, come on. Come on. Keep on trucking, girlfriend. Perfect. No promotion, but we will definitely be set to get one um, next time. So before we do anything, let's listen to a gardening tab cast. And uh, we need to have some fun. Where's our boy, Forrest? I don't see him. Is he outside? Hold on. Let's, uh... Oh, he's upstairs. <laughs> Alright, let's come funny, make a silly face. You can't get in our garden forest. Or can he? If you're an adult, you might get that. <laughs> oh, dear. Okay, listen to cooking tab cast. And let's um enthuse about work. Talk about gardening. Sometimes I wonder what my neighbors think I'm talking about <laughs> when they're in the hallway. Because we live in an apartment building and you can kind of hear a little bit um just because of where our desks are, like if you're in the hallway and it's quiet, you could probably hear someone talking, so they probably just walk by all the time thinking I'm just some crazy person talking to myself. But that wouldn't be completely inaccurate, would it? No. Alright, come on, Forrest, let's just... Can we... Can we get something going here? I think we can. Let's compliment his dashing appearance. She's like, look at me, I look so cute and nerdy and scientific. You know you want some of this. Let's give him some flowers. Why not? What do you want, Sarah? Let's confess our attraction. And first kiss. <laughs> With Sarah complaining in the background. Oh yay, he's our romantic interest. How cute! So let's hold hands. And then we should probably have her come down and cook a little something for dinner. Um, or I guess I can just let one of them do it because they all love to cook. So we'll let someone handle the cooking while we... Um, did you ever put on your tab cast? Cooking. And come in here and tend the garden. Cute. Her and Forrest are officially romantic interests. Uh, let's put this book away. I love how they're not even cooking, they're just eating like quick meals. Ay, ay, ay. I guess we'll have her come down here and serve some spaghetti. While we can, before she gets super pissed. Come on, girl. You can do it. You can do it. Arkenshire is now an amateur gamer. Hooray for you. Oh, girl, come on. 
Ugh, burning the spaghetti. Why are you always burning the spaghetti? Alright, let's see if we can... Oh, no, no. Are we friends with you? Are we friends with Caleb? No, we're not. Okay. Well, we need to see if we can grab this bed then, quickly. And let's see, how long has this part been? About 25 minutes, so I think this is a good place to stop. Um, we did pretty good. We got 3,000 simoleons from that statue we made. Uh, we had our first kiss with Forrest, and we have, you know, still been picking away at our little um, roommates here. Uh, so yeah, I will see you guys next time.